AM 1260 KLYC, and one of the things we're doing is out and about with the Yam Van, finding out what's going on in uh, uh, Yam Hill County. And we are here in the storage room. Uh, there's wine barrels everywhere. We're here at Ken Wright Cellars, and we just happened to walk in the door, and there was a health safety class going on. And I was talking to Ken Wright a moment ago, and the industry actually helps sponsor health care for migrant workers that work in the viticultural industry. Lita Garside is with, uh, what's the name of your company? Tuality Healthcare. And it's funded by the uh, vineyard growers. It, yes, it is. The, the program is. Explain the program for me, please. It is a migrant outreach program for migrant workers and their families, those who work in the wine industry. And so the wine growers actually are helping to pay for health care for their workers. Yes, by participating in a wine auction that we do once a year, we, uh, we get the funds to provide the services. And what kind of services do you provide? Uh, we do a lot of uh, health education, outreach services, a lot of um, mainly comprehensive and is, is um, preventative, a lot of prevention. T taking people, making sure that people are away from the emergency room. That's a good thing. And as we walked in, apparently today, and in fact behind me right now, they're doing some training for a number of vineyards and, I guess, uh, supervisors that work in the vineyard industry on CPR and so on and so forth for emergency um, medical care if it's needed in the field. That's correct. It's, uh, in this area, particularly in the rural area, it's very important to have, to have this training because emergency services are a little bit farther than in the urban area so it's it's good to have people train in case of an emergency so the vineyard growers are helping to provide health care for workers that's correct so your your name is walter harden you're a doctor of osteopath and you're also involved with the program yes i am i'm the medical director and have been working with Leda in this for um i can't remember how many years <laughs> 10 or maybe 10 and I just work with Leda in helping with uh, their policies and over with um, talking with Leda about what's needed in, for the SLUD program, basically. I do participate in some of the committees and um, work with uh, other, other participants in, in the uh, program also. Any new offerings, any new programs coming out? Oh, they have a new program, a mobile clinic that's coming out, and they will be providing services uh, that we haven't, been, haven't had directly other than getting them from another uh, from the Adventist hospital basically and now we will be able to have our own unit take go out to the vineyards and have the workers come in and be tested through our our facility if you want to call it a mobile facility so you'll be doing things like screening minor medical care that kind of thing sore throats uh yes yeah they, they do mostly screening as mostly prevented but yes if they have other issues they they can be handled with this clinic all right. What's the name of the program again? It's Salud. Salud. Yes, it's uh, S A L U D. How wide of an area do you cover? Oregon? I think uh, not all of Oregon. We, there's a certain defined area, and later could probably tell you more about the defined area. Our area is the North Willamette Valley. Home base is Hillsboro uh, because that's quality healthcare. But we go as far south as Lorain, Oregon. Well, thank you very much for your time today. You're welcome. Pleasure. And we are here at Ken Wright Cellars, and we'll let the class get underway once again. I'm Dave Adams, AM 1260 KLYC.